If you're wondering why so many Japanese men are so curious about this bar, it's because all of the waitresses working here are real Japanese porn stars. I've been there, and boy do I have a story for you. Subscribe to this channel so you don't miss this future video. In the meantime... Hey guys, welcome to another episode, and today I'm going to answer a frequently asked question I often get from people back home in Australia, from my sick friends. You know who you are. And the question is, do they actually have those used girls' panties vending machines here in Japan? You know, that's a question I've actually been wondering myself ever since I was a high school student back in the 90s, because I heard a lot about it myself as well. But I don't know if it's actually a myth or if they do actually exist. And to be honest, in the four years I've been in Japan, I've never actually physically seen one. And I did a bit of research and it seems that there might be one left and it's here in Akihabara. And I think I know exactly where it is. So we're going to suss it out and finally we're going to be able to answer the question that everyone's always been asking. There are signs all over this joint that say don't take pictures or film, so I have to be discreet as possible. I'm a tall, slightly overweight Aussie guy holding a giant camera next to my hip for crying out loud. Alright, here it is. It looks more like a gumball machine. What the hell is this? This isn't anything like I imagined. As a 16 year old kid, when you hear stories about things like this in the school playground, you image a giant vending machine with flashing lights and pictures of the girls next to the goodies. And just when I couldn't feel any more disappointed, it's empty. No more panties. I gotta say, like, in one way I'm kind of disappointed, but on the other hand, it's probably a good thing that they're gone. I mean, what was the end game in this video? I have to buy a pair because you want to see it. And then you're probably going to ask me what do they smell like? So I'd have to sniff them, then my wife would see the video and get really angry with me, but then I've been divorced. How can I explain myself? Anyway, there you have it. No more panties. Sorry to disappoint you. Hiya. Hey. Hiya, Chan. Hey. Today, I attempted to make a video in mm. Akihabara mm. because many of my friends in Australia wanted mm. to know about these panties vending machines in, in Japan. Mm. And I found one. Mm -hmm. But. It was empty and I asked the lady, like, are you going to restock it? And she said, no, like, it's finished. No more panties. So, it, it's, it's over. The panty vending machine is over in Japan. So, I uh, Recent, I, I had that article uh, <laughs> recently. Uh, junior high school or high school or university girl sell the used mask for all the men. <laughs> Do you want to buy? <laughs> no, I don't want to buy. What? What? Are you telling me that... I work in a junior high school. Junior high school girls and mm. high school girls at the university are, are selling their, their masks. Yep. And, Make and people money. Are, are buying these. Yep. Well, why would anyone want that? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> like same as uh, panty? <laughs> what use? <laughs> What's used for? I, I, I don't know. Maybe someone's collecting panties and yeah. mask and getting yeah. like some combination happening. But do you have any idea like how much money they're selling it for? Yeah, I don't know. A thousand yen? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Is there a market out there for like foreign guys like me? Like I can sell my mask. No. To people like no one interested. 